So in the first round, uh, Rainier's opponent didn't even bother really to engage. We'll see if the Belarusian does a better job at least of getting Teddy to sweat a bit here. Oh, and that was nice. A little look at Sasai there. Mm. And Vakaviak. <laughs> he comes around the belt there. Doesn't get it there. And Rainier just flattens him with Osoto. But he drops on his butt mm. instead of his back. They were still in the tatami. One of them was. There's no need to call that, Mate. I think it might be reviewed here. Did the Mate influence the throw? See? The throw was underway as the referee was calling it. It might have. No, the uh, opinion was that the Mate influenced the the blue player's action. I Therefore, see. Um, no, he stopped. Right, um, and allowed Rainier to yeah, uh, exactly to drop him. Sometimes if it's the call is simultaneous with the action, where you can absolutely guarantee that there was no um, influence, then it can be given. Here we go. There we go. So Rainier dispatches him nonetheless, this time in the middle of the tatami. Yes. Well, there was no same doubt. Technique. That's right. Yeah. <laughs> Almost like a plaything. That's right. Yeah. Well, it's a highlight of this. It's just... Uh... It's almost a carbon copy of what we saw on the edge of the tatami. Yeah, yeah, well. yeah. Just uses all that leverage. And it, it's, it's good enough that he doesn't even have to follow down no. to the ground. <laughs> and normally, I would be, you know, yeah. why is he not, you know, doing the